Hello my Salopian Minecrafters and welcome back to another episode of Shrewsbury in Minecraft. I have not put one of these out for a while so I apologise to anybody who has been wanting to see some. Uh, at the same time I've been doing a bit of the boring stuff off camera so uh, round here we were working round the back of the shops the other day weren't we? Uh, round the back of the uh, Millbrace Retail Park. Round here um, I, I've done a little bit of work connecting up this pathway here. I've changed a little bit of the the height of the road here. So now as you're coming up here, there's no road markings yet or the side of the road or anything. But this is where it starts forking off for Bannatine's leisure and golf and whatever. So that's off over there. In fact, Bannatine doesn't own the golf, does it? Uh, that's still municipal. And, oh, yeah, I'm working quite a lot on this bloody pain in the backside roundabout. You see, I haven't even filled in all the trees yet. I'm going to go around a lot in a bit and bang in some like woodland flowers and stuff. And that'll, you know, kind of add a little bit of something. Kind of a bit of double height stuff here and there as well. So you can see it's you know it does does add like a little bit. Let's let's just do a little section here just with that. And if I was to pick up instead some of this stuff, a little bit of brush round the bottom here. So it looks like get out of there, please, if you don't mind. So we'll have this going all the way through to the back there and stuff. So it just kind of looks fully overgrown because it is fully overgrown they've also got a couple of rocks on the other side now haven't they i say now like they've only just <laughs> like they've only just popped up they've been there for for donkey's years but uh i can sort that out as well off camera because that's just mega boring stuff oh more mega boring stuff i also added this little bit here and i've now got the basic shape for the road that goes up that way. What is it? Um, there's Otley Road and then there's blah, 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 Road. The one that goes up towards, oh, is it Rebrooks up that way, isn't it? So I can get that done as well. And the road's got to go downwards to go over. You can see over here, I've got the train tracks going. Now this needs to go down and underneath those train tracks because those train tracks will be part of, uh, there's a bridge that goes over this road. So that'll be done in the future. It actually doesn't look bad right there, does it? That does look like a, like an intersection. It looks like the intersection. But I thought we'd do something. This this episode, this time, this week, this, this, this year. This year! Happy New Year, by the way. We're going to finish off this, because it's the only thing that's not done in this section over here. I can also put in some cars just to fill up some space. I've got, got a little car over there. Just just things like that. I know it's like a little roadster, but it's hard to make cars that small, you know, that don't look just ridiculous. First things first though, let's uh toggle the downfall. I know it's I know it's more authentic having rain in Shrewsbury, but but let's let's not for a day. So you can see Let's, let's just have a little look at the front here. I'd started off uh, Costa. God, I swear it's so bloody loud outside. Give me a second here while I let this car go past. Well, I'm not sure if that's any uh, any quieter in the background. Hopefully it will be, though. Hopefully it will be. Um, let's take this back anyway. That doesn't, that doesn't belong there. It's got to follow this line back from here. And it's not going to be brick. This side is also... Let's take it back to there. It's also going to be a little bit of this work, isn't it? I'm going to... Because I can't quite remember how far that goes. I'm going to go to here. And then make a... Make a window there. Because I can see up the side of it. I'm As usual, I'm using... Google... Google Earth just to just to remind myself of what things look like let's get a little bit of light grey going to the end here and that does go to the end because I've seen it from the other side as well let's also change up for some bricks here 
because this backside definitely is bricks. But you can see the materials I'm using for Costa at least. They're the dark, you know, the black glass. So let's get some of that on our hot bar. I should keep a few of the gra gra grass blocks there. Let's take this all the way to the end as well. Yeah. And on this backside, it is just bricks up to where the. How far does this go now? See, I think there's a window on this side as well. Let's make this window the same size. So it will be up to there. And is it as dark, do we reckon? I don't think it's going to be as dark. But, and there's definitely a pillar of bricks on this side. Let's let's do it the same any hoozle. Go across like that. And that shouldn't look too bad. It should look pretty pretty modern. Yeah, I'm sure it's supposed to be like a modern sort of build. I, I imagine it is. But this will be one of the first times we do some proper building on camera and it's only a little place. So it means we can do it without fear of bleh, making an idiot of Thor all his life. Uh -huh. Let's go around here. This might be pretty much the outside of the building completed. And we'll do some slabs on the front here. In fact, I think I'm going to just slab all the way over the top now without yeah, without you guys with me, because all I'm going to do is take it over on an overhang by one block all the way around and fill that in. I'll meet you afterwards. Right, so we've got a top on it, which makes me feel good. Um, this side over here is a uh, car phone warehouse, isn't it? And I don't know what's in the middle. So let's do a similar thing that we've done with the Costa sign over here. And get rid of that. We'll have... Oh, where are we going to stick our, our door and windows and that? Right, so door, let's call this the door no, let's go for a too wide gap there yeah that'll do just fine and then we can have no let's have a one wide gap here actually how have I done the door oh I've just done like a little glass thing I don't need to that's much better that's a much better idea Let's go out by at least two then, and then open a door off this way, and we can have that open, and bleh, come on, yeah, so we've got a door open there, in fact we can get rid of them, have it only, because that's two meters high then, most people can fit through that, I'm absolutely sure they can. Um, and we'll carry on the glass over here. What I was going to say though is I've received a couple of requests, or at least one request, I can't remember if it's a couple now, to make a, a tutorial over there of the greenhouse meadow. That is most definitely on hold for the moment because it is just too big a job for me to to just come out and do. I mean, it's a big, big build. If more people, though, if a, you know, if a couple more people want to see that, then let me know. And you know, if it's if it's for if it's for a bigger sort of thing, then I might be tempted because. I mean, I, as much as I like doing things just for, just, f well, just to be personable, just to help a brother out, you know, I, I can't do something that size just, just on a whim. It's going to take me hours and hours and hours just to, just to work out a nice easy way to, 
Um, talk. Yeah, it's plenty good, that is. Car phone warehouse. Eat your heart out. Uh, so, yeah, I, I, I just need more people if that's going to be something that, that ever happens. And there's one of them there. But there's no sign on it. That's why I can't tell what's what's happening there. Pain. So yeah, requests for that. If you would like to see it in the future, then let me know if, if, if you'd get some use out of it. Uh, in the meantime, the reason I haven't really been doing much of this is just it's 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 the work. I, I do quite a bit on on YouTube anyway. You know, I've got quite a few series going at once. I probably spread myself a little thin. Let's just remind ourselves that there's a wall there, and there'll be a wall here. And then what are we going to use for flooring? I don't want to use the same stuff, but I could use what slabs have we got here? Slabs. Stone slabs. There we go. So that'll look nice. Um, I do get asked quite often if I'm actually from Shrewsbury, and yes, yes, of course I am. I certainly wouldn't go to all this bother doing all this rubbish if I uh, if I wasn't. I also, I, I mean, I actually came, grew up over there in Meal Estate. Loved it. Rough round here, but. Uh, <laughs> It's not. It's lovely. So, yeah, that's why I chose this part of the world to start on. Things I'm going to do in the future probably are, well, I mean, I'm not probably going to go much further up this way. I might just carry on and do, I mean, I did get a little bit of something down for starting off Sainsbury's there do a little bit of landscaping for it and I might take the the estate up to the same place but I can't carry on up that way forever because I'll just end up in Basin Hill so I'm more thinking I'm going to start taking it towards town that could be a bother though because roads won't be straight I wonder if I can even be heard over the top of <laughs> all of this breaking of blocks. So, yeah, it's a... Uh, I hopefully that'll be okay, because not having straight roads means not having straight houses. Which means that if I want to make houses up there, I've got to do them on a slant, which does not work in Minecraft. The only other way round doing that is... Uh, straighten off the houses even though they're on a on a wonky road sometimes that's the, that looks all right it can definitely be something we can try I'd probably take Hereford Road up that way because it's it seems like the quickest way to town I'd, I'd prefer to do that than just do miles of road and hardly any houses going up towards Rebrook and taking the old pots way into town. Town would be great though, that's what I really want to do. I'd love to do the town centre. That's where I actually live now. Which is which is very nice, very handy. Very handy for the pubs and uh, if you ever need to get from point A to point B you've got your train station and other decent uh, public transport. It's going to be very small in there. I'm thinking it might not feel quite so small if I use this for the actual walls on the inside, and I think I'm right. So let's do that. Actually, we do the whole way, or do we keep like a little border here? I think I think that will probably look better. And if it's wrong placement, uh, I'm still not going to do the inside of any of these. I don't think. 
because if I ever do open this up on a server, which is something I'm thinking about actually, when I do get to a thousand subscribers, I can set up a, a donation account for for the channel, and then I would set up donations to run a so server, grab a server host, and set up Shrewsbury so that people can visit it online. I mean that would be my top my top thing so people can run around it. I mean you could even use it for for weird stuff like um you know we could have like a zombie apocalypse here or something and you know do like a survival sort of games thing here. Loads of great ideas but I can't do anything with that. I'm not going to set up PayPal details or anything like that. Uh until I can you know, set up a donation system through YouTube. I think I think that's the best way. Also, I don't want to be just one of those guys with. Because what am I on now? Six hundred and seventy odd subs. Just oh, I'm a tiny little YouTuber. Donate money to me, because I don't want money myself. I've got all my, I've got all my equipment. I'm fine. So, you know, it only be for setting up a server. But that's that's you know that's by the by that's in the future. I've just seen these. These are a good idea. Why didn't I have them before? By the way, they're they're done now. <laughs> uh, I could try and find some way of putting like a motif on them. But you can see how I've done my. Oh, there's not an Argos one up. There's not a next one. There's, none of these are up. Just the boots one. And the M and S one that just says M and S. <laughs> so that's that. But round the back here where I was doing the work before, I think, yeah, yeah, this will definitely look better. A couple of them. Oh, they definitely look like they'll open now. These kind of storage container things. No, not in the middle. I think they look better on the sides like that. So basically, this episode is done. Why are we still raining it's always raining in shrewsbury it's it's like the shrewsbury simulator anyway that is that as i said put in requests if you want to see this we'll say you know if 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 20 people ask me just 20 then i'll do it because you know it's a guarantee 20 views at least but more people will watch i'm sure especially now that the channel is growing quite a bit because I've probably I've probably grown by two or three, well, at least two hundred I reckon since subscribers since the last video in Shrewsbury. So there you go, hey, fantastic, Shrewsbury YouTuber. Just I'm I'm going to the top next PewDiePie. <laughs> All right, well uh, thank you so much for watching this episode of Shrewsbury in Minecraft. If you enjoyed it, please press the like button. It helps helps out so much. And if you would like to see more of this and you're a first time viewer, then why not subscribe? Give it a go. You might like what you see. And I will see you guys in the next episode. Take it easy.